I like that there is something for everyone to do. Here on a beautiful cruise ship. However, complaints, way too many children. Never feels really crowded for even how big this ship actually is. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your host, Vince. We are currently on board Icon of the Seas and we wanna know, what do you like about Icon? So we're going around asking different guests, what do they like about Icon of the Seas? So let's find out. What's your name? My name is Allison. Allison, where are you from? From Long Island, New York. So tell me, what do you like about Icon of the Sea so far? We're loving it. It's iconic. We are having the best time here. Uh, we are third time World Caribbean cruisers and this just really brings it up a notch. Have you faced any challenges on the ship so far? Um, not really. It's it's the design is incredible. It's really everything's accessible. Uh, the elevator system is game game changing. No waiting online for the elevators. Um, we're just we're loving it. So, what do you say you take away from this experience or this trip? My husband will be at next cruise, right. booking the next <laughs> Royal Caribbean vacation, probably on the ship. Your name. Valerie. Valerie. I'm Robert. Uh, Robert. And where are you guys from? New Jersey. What do you guys like about Icon? What's your thoughts? Icon has a lot to offer. A lot, you know, I, I'd say anybody. Okay. Um, you can do as much as you want or as little as you want. Right. Yeah, there, but there's many different things that you can do. I think it's a great ship. Um, it's huge, mm -hmm. you know, but it's a great ship. What's your name? My name is Jenna. And where are you from? Philadelphia. Philadelphia. All right, we're going to ask you, so what do you like about Icon of the Sea? I like how much there is to do. Um, one thing that I found really special about this ship is last night we did the Empire Supper Club, which was phenomenal. It was amazing. Everything tasted so good. The service was amazing. The live music, the whole experience was just really great. So first of all, tell me, what is your name? My name is Nick. Nick. Mm -hmm. So where are you from? I'm from Trinidad. Trinidad. Mm -hmm. What do you like about Icon? Hmm. I like so much things about Icon. I like the people most importantly. I like my colleagues, like these guys behind here. Um, I like all the activities they have for y'all to do. So much things to do for y'all. We like interacting with the guests, making sure they have a good experience. So what is your name? Hi, I'm Max. Hi, Max. Where are you from? I'm from Miami. Oh, great. Miami. We're from Miami, too. Home of the Icon, right? Yes. So tell me, what do you like about Icon? So Icon's great. I think it's a new class of Royal Caribbean ships. It's really revolutionized in so many different ways. You know, the different neighborhoods, the food options, the cleanliness, the rooms, uh, even for the staff. I think the, the new categorized rooms is really great. I think the Royal Caribbean executive team did a really great job with the design. Hey, my name is Beth. And where are you from? I'm from Steamboat Springs, Colorado. Oh, great. All right, so what do you like about Icon? What don't I like about Icon? Honestly, it is amazing. The vibrancy and the colors. Um, I love the eating options, dining options. I haven't even been to the main dining room except for sip tour brunch that we did today. And the biggest upgrade I want to say is the bathrooms in the staterooms. The bathrooms. <laughs> yes. Absolutely. Being able to actually, you know, have a door and not have water going everywhere. Fantastic. <laughs> so what would you say is your takeaway on Icon? My takeaway on Icon is that is up the royal game of like any new ships coming out. Um, I love big ships, but I want a smaller ship with all these same similar amenities and pluses and technology. It's just, it's a game changing ship. Hi, what is your name? My name is Shella Buchanan. Hi, so where are you from? I'm originally from the island of St. Kitts, but I live in Virginia. Oh, great. So tell me, what do you like about Icon of the Sea? Well, we are actually here celebrating my girlfriend's 50th birthday celebration. And I like every night we had a theme. And when we went into the uh, dining area, everybody was like cheering for us because we were so vibrant and uh, uplifting. And so, but I like the uh, ambiance of the whole ship. I feel like it's upscale. I feel like this is where I'm supposed to be. I'm not supposed to be doing a nine to five. <laughs> I'm supposed to be living in luxury like this, so I, I feel like we've experienced every part of the ship 
and it's been a wonderful experience. This is what my life is supposed to be about. I agree, I agree. <laughs> Hi, what is your name? Hi, uh, Gregorio. Gregory Gre Mann. Gregory <laughs> Mann, so where are you from? We're from Florida, Port St. Lucie. Oh, right in our backyard, Miami. We're from Miami. New York. Okay, New York, but you moved down to Port St. Lucie. We're still Florida. <laughs> All right, so I tell me, what do you like about Icon? People are so friendly. The crew, especially, they're very well, accommodating. We like two shows. We saw The Wizard of Oz, and the ice skating show was fabulous. It was fantastic, Darker. fabulous. Darker. It was excellent. I loved it. Recommend it to everybody. Come on, the Icon of the Sea. All right, what is your name? Alonso. Alonso, where are you from? I'm, I'm from Mexico City. Oh, Mexico City in the house. Hello. Hello. Hey, so tell us, what do you like about Icon? Everything. This is the most iconic cruise i ever been. What is your name? Tashara. And where are you from? New York. All right. So tell me, what do you like about Icon of the Seas? What do I like about it? I would definitely say, and I know I heard someone else saying this, it does give a variety. So no matter what caliber of person that you have on the ship, age, gen uh, nationality and such, it's something for everybody to do. As well as the, the I don't want to say the layout, but the ideas of the different towns, little community, Central Park, all that, I think that's really cool. Hi, what is your name? Jennifer. Jennifer, where are you from? From Virginia Beach. From Virginia Beach. So can you tell me what do you like about Icon? I love everything about Icon, but especially love all the new food options. What is your name? Clifton, from Jamaica. Okay. Her. What do you like about Icon of the Seas? Icon of the Seas is one of a kind ship. It's have a lot of different things, amenities, amenities about the ship. Especially the, the Central Park is different. The um, promenade deck is two, five and six. That's a big difference. You can see on both sides, outside, through the glass, and we never have a ship like that before. And the Icon, it have a good background of experienced crew members. All right, so tell me, what do you like about Icon? I like the water slides and like all the restaurants. It's really nice. All right. uh, is there anything that you didn't like or you faced some challenges on the ship? Um, well, the, there were these girls that were like making, like they were flipping us off and they were like being mean to us, but that's it. How would you rate it from a one to 10? Um, a 10. A 10, there we go. Hi, what is your name? Lori. Lori, where are you from? New York. New York. So tell me, what do you like about Icon of the Sea? I just love the layout of the ship, the tremendous amount of food options and places to sit, and really cool. Actually, you know what I think is cool about this one too? There's a lot of cool like nooks to hang out in and different places to sit and chill no matter like what the vibe is. I think that's really cool. And there's just lots of places to be. It never feels really crowded for even how big this ship actually is. Hi, what is your name? Lisa. Where are you from? Houston, Texas. Houston, Texas. So what do you like about Icon of the Seas? I love how high tech it is. The elevators are cool. The room keypads are cool. Um, waving your hand in front of a lot of doors. Just <laughs> the tech is cool. All the places to chill. Like this concept of like being in the AC and like still getting sun and enjoying the view is like amazing. Um, lots of options for food. And there's just so much that I love about the Icon. So what would you say is your takeaway from Icon? It's, I think it's worth the extra splurge because it's the newest and the best. Yeah. So, I mean, there's a little premium for that. And then um, I think that just having this first-class staff that has been on a lot of ships and has a lot of experience. Right. Um, we get all of them on this ship, right. so that's like a big plus. My name is LaShawn Wallace. And where are you from? I'm from Chicago, Illinois. And hey, so tell me, what do you like about Icon? The thing that I love most about Icon, as big as a ship is, it doesn't feel overpopulated. She just... I love the space. I love how they have the boat separated in different uh, compartments. Typically on a regular Royal, we're looking for a lot of seats. As you see, there's a lot of seats <laughs> available. I mean, it just doesn't feel crowded like the regular boat stools. I love how they just broke the department, and broke down the ship in different 
neighborhoods. So this is what I love about the ship. Of course, Windjammer is always on the money. <laughs> yes, that's what I love about it. Hi, what's your name? My name is Peter. Hi, Peter. Where are you from? From Steamboat Springs, Colorado. And what is your name? Julian. Julian. And you're from also Colorado, right? Yeah. All right. So what do you like about Icon? Wow. I mean, I love all the space, all the different venues. You can get away and it doesn't feel crowded. I mean, here we are on a sea day um, in the Overlook and, you know, there's maybe 20, 25 people in here and it's a beautiful day. So that, that probably my favorite. The new elevators are great and the shower. I'm, I'm a bigger guy, you know, I'm not a not hard travel guy big, you know, I'm not seven foot tall, but I can move around and I don't bang my elbows and yeah, it's great. So what do you like about Icon? Um, I like all the new like eating venues. I feel like on the old ships it was like five restaurants and that was it. There was like no way of, unless you wanted quick food, like the only quick food option was like a Loco Fresh or the Windjammer, but now they have so many more options. Right, I agree. So have you been to Surfside? Yes. What do you think about Surfside? It's pretty cool. Always crowded though. Yeah? Yeah. It's a lot of kids? Yeah. So is that the downfall for Surfside? Yeah, yeah. definitely. I agree with all the extra complimentary and new places that we're able to eat. So what would you say is your takeaway from Icon? Wow, I mean, it's a great ship. I, I really, I mean, I know it's it's expensive right now, but I think it's, it's well worth it. Um, you know, it's a great family vacation. There's something for everybody. And that's the most important thing. Hi, what is your name? Hi, my name is Sabrina. Hi, Sabrina, where are you from? We're both from Los Angeles, California. Oh, great. Okay, so what do you like about Icon of the Sea? I don't think there's a thing that I don't like. Like, just the environment, the excursions, the shows, like the stops that we stop at, like what we can do. Like, it's all been amazing. And the singers, you know, it's all such a vibe. The drinks. <laughs> so we've been enjoying the, the coladas. Oh, yeah? I need to try that one. Oh, okay. Alright, so tell me, what do you like about Icon? I like that there is something for everyone to do. There are different areas you can experience this, especially because we're here with a group. And today we are trying to, you know, come out of our shell and do something different. So we're having a pool day. Um, there are lots of different avenues that you can partake in. I love Central Park. It's beautiful. And it's not something that you will normally see on a ship, especially something of this size. So, great addition. Hi, what is your name? My name is Bill. Bill, where are you from? Buffalo. Go Bills. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, so, what do you like about Icon? I like a lot of things. What I mostly like about maybe cruising in general is every night's date night. So, you know, you're going to dinner. You're going to spend a little time at the casino. Maybe go to a nightclub. My wife and I, we, we love being at home, so when we go on a cruise, we do all the date stuff that we don't normally do. But I, I like the wide, the new design, the bright colors. Um, I like a lot about it. So you want to tell me what you like about Icon? Um, I really like how the golf course is on this ship, and it's like, on like the other ships, I like always used to get lost, but like on this one, it's very organized. It's very easy. So, have you been to Surfside? Yes. What do you think about it? Um, it's pretty cool. Very colorful. Hi. What is your name? Jill. Jill. Where are you from? Long Island, New York. Long Island, New York, in the house. <laughs> so, tell me, what do you like about Icon? Well, I love that the fe of how big it is, and you feel how there's a lot of people here, but you don't see all the people. So it's great. There's a lot of room to move. So have you faced any challenges? What not to eat? <laughs> Food is delicious. That's my only challenge. The con, I, uh -oh, I would say we got a con. right now, <laughs> it's just that there's so many children on. Yeah. And not that, you know, children have a place to, so I'm not saying, I don't want to cruise with children, but there are a lot uh, okay. on um, this week. and. Um, you know, the areas that you would think they would be in, they're not in. So okay. they're all over. So how that's about, my comment. How about you, Robert? I like the neighborhoods. I like it segmented. I just don't think, to my <laughs> wife's point, the con is kids. And I don't think Royal is right now segmenting those neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. So, but once they do that, I think it's a great family cruise. It's yeah. a lot to yeah. do, like she said. There's a lot of places to hide. A lot when of places we're in a, to eat. 
here in the dome and it's just cool. Yeah. Just sit in the front of the ship and chill. Okay. Yeah. What's your name? Aileen. Aileen, where are you from? Now, Port St. Lucie, Florida. Oh, my Floridian people. Another Port St. Lucie, Florida way, in the house. Way of Jersey. Way of Jersey. Well, we're from Miami, Florida. So you guys are right in our backyard. Okay, so tell me, what do you like about Icon of the Sea? As our first cruise, it's pretty amazing. We love everything. I think we love the music. We love the food. We love everything. Great. The, the drinks. The drinks. The drinks. No, the people, the staff, the crew is really great. Everyone's been great. So this has been like an amazing first experience for you guys. Amazing. It has really been, yeah. Definitely. I'm really glad you guys really enjoy it. So, hi, what is your name? Brenda from Mexico. Yeah. Brenda from Mexico. What do you like about Icon? To be honest, everything. The crew areas. Yeah, we have uh, everything there. Uh, library, we have the ping pong table, pool table, even footballito. The crew cabins are the best, I think so. And of course, in the guest areas, I think most of it, the restaurants, uh, the pools, all around, all around. Uh, my name is Rick. Where are you from? Uh, we're from the Netherlands. 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 Wow, yes. All right, so what do you like about Icon so far? Uh, I like uh, the, on the Icon the food and uh, all the amazing slides uh, here on the ship. Is there something that you don't like or you face challenges? Mm, no, I, I really, really like it here. Hi, what is your name? Kerry. Carrie, where are you from? Arizona. Arizona in the house. What do you like about Icon? Well, so far everything's been fantastic. It's uh, one of the, the best ship I've ever been on. We've been on a lot of cruises. Is there anything that you don't like or any challenges that you faced while on Icon? Yes, we're, uh, we have to leave. <laughs> you don't want to leave? No, no, we're having a great time. Fan so would you book Icon again? Definitely. Definitely, we've had nothing but the best experience we've ever had. Sydney, where are you from? I'm from Virginia Beach. From Virginia Beach. Can you tell me what do you like about Icon? Um, I love the new hideaway. I think that's a really cool spot. So tell me, what do you like about Icon? Well, my girlfriend here just said everything that I was going to say, but I'm just going to say it again. Um, I just love the Icon because it's, it's actually catered to everyone, the whole entire family. So it doesn't matter if, you just, if you're here with family or as a couple, it's catered to everyone. And I just love the way they had, like she said, broke it up into the different uh, neighborhoods. And it doesn't feel crowded at all because I heard that this ship was actually at its capacity or whatever that is. I know it's a large number, but we didn't feel like we were like just, just being like a, like crowded at all. So I just love the way they just, just they designed this whole ship and we will be back real soon. I am not negative Nilly here on a beautiful cruise ship. However, complaints, way too many children, takes up every spot. As we can see, look at the jacuzzi. Can you turn, look at the jacuzzi? It is all kids. Children swimming without parent supervision. Where are their parents? Hey, what about the bar? The bar, the swim-up bar is all with children. Children in the swim-up bar. Nighttime, we go to have drinks at 10.30 at night in a piano bar, and what do we have? Children taking up seats and adults standing. Is there something that you don't like about it? Uh. I don't think so. I can't think of anything that I don't like so far. Any challenges you faced? No, no? nothing at all. All right. So how I mean, do you rate it from a 1 to 10? Uh, definitely a 10. A 10. Yes, it is. So how would you rate it from a 1 to 10? 10. A 10. 10, absolutely. <laughs> what do you rate it from 1 ah, to okay. 10? 11. <laughs> We got 11, our first 11 over here. Come from 1 to 10, like 10 as your highest, likely, and then 0 as we don't recommend it at all. Okay. What's your score? Hmm. I would say maybe an 8, okay. 8 or 9. That's, yeah. that's a high score? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How about you, Robert? I would say a 10. I mean, 10? Because it gives you everything. There's nothing that you really need on this ship. Right. And... Like I said, the kids are just a part of it. Um, mm -hmm. If you make it a family ship, 
and you put right. roller coasters and water right. slides and you all that here, kids. you're going to have kids. Right, 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 right. So I, I think it. I think they hit a home run with it. Yeah, you know? I, I agree. And, and and my eight or nine is not a bad eight or nine. No, no, no. It's just it's because that's a high score, like you said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, you know, but I think it's I think it's a great ship. Okay. Great. So how would you rate Royal Caribbean from oh well icon from a one to ten? Oh, that's a hard question. I'm a, I'm a really t I don't give tens, so it's really tough. It, it's got to blow me away. I think Icon of the Seas is probably about an 8.6, and the reason I give it that is because I still think we're in inaugural season. There's still a little, some flaws, but I think overall, you know, we're over the halfway point, and not yet a 10, but right, almost there. And how would you rate it? Oh, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Absolutely. All right. <laughs> so how would you rate it from a 1 to 10? I would give this boat a 10. So how would you rate it from a 1 to 10? And you can tell me why and what you don't like about it. Now, see, for me, unfortunately, I personally would probably give it a 5. Ooh. But that's me comparing to, you know, other cruises I've been to. I, I've barely been able to find my family on this ship. I spent a lot of time. I'm here with a group of like 12 people. I spent a lot of time by myself because I can't find them once we separate. It's like when somebody tell you where they are, you get there, they're gone. And it's full. It's just, the ship is too big for my liking. So how would you rate from a 1 to 10? Of the entire ship or that in particular? The entire ship. I would give it a 10. A 10? Oh, we got a 10. <laughs> did you face any challenges? Yeah, did you have any challenges while on the ship or something that you didn't like? Um, I would say there were a lot of pool closures and I don't know if it was just because of our sailing and just happened that way but other than that no not really so how would you rate icon from a 1 to 10 Ooh, a solid 9.5 because nothing's perfect right? right nothing's perfect but it's amazing a 10, a 10. oh no doubt absolutely we got another 10 over here what about you? How would you rate Icon from 1 to 10? It is my first cruise, but I would also give it a 10. It's going to be hard to beat this one. Yeah. So is there something that you didn't like or you want to tell me something that you like? I would like a few more pools and jacuzzis open after hours, but oh, that's it. Yes, after hour jacuzzis Some is a more vibe. Stuff for the adults later when the kids are asleep. Uh, that'd, be, that'd probably be the only thing. I'd rate Icon 10 times 2. 10 times 2. That's 20. So how would you rate Icon from 1 to 10? 10. A, a ten. ten. A ten. The drinks, we got a ten over here. The drinks are fantastic. Well, he's, he's, he's drink, well, we've been drinking from... No, it's a, it's a wonderful cruise. It's beautiful. Everybody's so accommodating. The people are so, so friendly. And the staff is outstanding. Very nice, like you people. We go to dinner every night. The food has been delicious. My, I probably gained 20 pounds already, unfortunately. This is, this is going to kill me. You <laughs> rate... <laughs> Icon from a scale from one to ten on this stuff. Three. Ooh. That's okay. It's because of the kids, yeah. 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 And we don't have any kids. No, I, I have kids, yeah. And yeah. Yeah. How about yourself? How would you? I would have to go with a five Ooh. just because of the kids. <laughs> but I'm ready to be a grandma soon, and I have three raised kids, but I want a little bit of a different environment not getting rid of the kids just shuffling back to where the thrill island is would be nice <laughs> so how would you rate icon from a one to ten a one to ten at this moment with a new ship and being here i think because i came with a group of persons um their distraction was great so in that regard i'll rate them a seven and a half seven and a half so how would you rate icon from a one to ten a 10. A 10. <laughs> yes. People, well, the staff is amazing. The staff? I give them a 20. If there was that, it was, if I go beyond 10 with these guys. It's a 10 plus. So on a scale from 1 to 10, how... Would I rate it? Yeah. 10. How would you rate it from a scale 10. from 1 to 10? 11 out of 10. And what, is that, what does that mean? Now, what does yeah. that look like? Because you have everything that's above and beyond that the cruise ships never had before. So it will have the guests returning again. The drinks. The drinks are not strong enough. You know, um, so, you know, we have to buy extra shots to make it like, but I guess it's according to your palate, right? So, but 
It's been a wonderful experience. I can't say anything negative about it. The staff is courteous. Um, we try every night to tip our waiters and waitresses. Maybe one thing is like every day my account is hit with something. something yeah. So um, I have to go and find out. Well, what is this? I don't. I don't. I didn't spend any money today, but everything is explained to me. It's clear. Like I said, this is what my life is should be about. How would you rate it from a one to ten? From a one to ten, I will give it an eight. The reason why I will give it an eight because you know with everything you can get, you can be, you can improve, right? And because this is one of the newer ships. Um, you know, it, it could improve in whatever way. Like right now, we need island music. This is a West Indian um, kind of voyage because we went from here to St. Kitts, my beautiful island. <laughs> so I'm just feeling like around the clock, you know, just know your audience. You have a lot of Caribbean people on here. Even people who are not from the Caribbean love the Caribbean ambiance. And so I will say music, West Indian music, live band all day. How would you rate it from a 1 to 10? I would give it a 10. A 10? I would give it a 10. All right. I would perfect. Give it a 10. We have another 10 here. <laughs> Is there any challenges or something that you don't like about Icon? I wish the, there were a bar closer to the smoking section. Okay. That, that would be nice. Um, and the, the pizza is just mediocre. It's frozen. It's frozen pizza. I mean, I like pizza. If It was just like we went on um, Harmony. And it's the exact same thing. It was a pizza full of disappointment. But I'm nitpicking. Staff is great. It's so clean. Uh, when we eat uh, in the dining room, I'm just amazed. This symphony of people, the dance they do to make it all happen. Um, specialty restaurants. Specialty restaurants are great. Everything you'd want and more. So how would you rate Icon from a 1 to 10? I'd give it a 9.8. Wow. 9.8? Yeah. It, you know, the pizza and the bar being close to the smoking section brought it down those two, brought it down a little bit. How would you rate it from a 1 to 10? 11. 11. I think this is our fourth Not 11. Not working here, but it's the best. It's the best. So we have another 11 here. There we have it from Brenda. So how would you rate Icon from a 1 to 10? Mm, 12 out of 10. A 12 out of 10. Hi, what is your name? Michael. Michael, where are you from? Orlando, Florida. Oh, our peoples, we're from Miami. <laughs> um, so what do you like about Icon of the Seas? I love the theme and the artwork throughout the entire boat. It's very uh, South Beach vibe to it, and it's absolutely gorgeous. How would you rate it from a 1 to 10? 1 to 10, I rate 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10. All right, there you go. Hi, what is your name? I'm Megan. Megan, and you're from Orlando, Florida as well. I am, yep. So what do you like about Icon of the Sea? I like how it's broken up into neighborhoods. It doesn't feel super crowded, even though it's the biggest ship in the world. So I love that you can go one place, it's doing one thing, the next place is doing something else. It feels like a completely different vibe. Great. So how would you rate it from a 1 to 10? I would say a 9 also. Nine. Mm -hmm. Uh, what I like the most, uh, uh, I think, um, yeah, just uh, the cruise in general, all the different places we go to, and just uh, the fun here on the ship. Okay. So from a 1 to 10, 1 being the poorest and 10 being the, the best, how would you rate Icon? I would give it a 10. A 10, so we have a 10 over here. So what is your takeaway from Icon? Well, my takeaway would be just uh, everybody has been so friendly and everybody has been, uh, uh, you know, just asking us every moment if we, need, if we needed something and it's just been, uh, food's been fantastic. So I would tell anybody and everybody that we've been, you know, that we, we come in contact with to, uh, to come on the Icon. It's been fantastic. So with that being said, how would you rate Icon from a 1 to 10? 10, no doubt. 10. We have another perfect 10. <laughs> Thank you so much.